Hi there everyone, it's Kevin again. Um, this video lesson um, for now will be the last <clears throat> video in this uh, thinkorswim uh, folder uh, in this tutorial section. It will it will absolutely not be the last time I talk about little tips and tricks uh, on this platform, but I think for now this will um, certainly help get you started, at least getting you used to a little bit of familiarity with the platform, kind of how to navigate it very simply stated, and then also how to follow along in future lessons that I show. You know, we start modeling trades and we start discussing, you know, my, my thought process on uh, trade management and trade planning and adjustments and things of that nature. Um, so this lesson, I want to just direct your attention to the help tab, all right? So this is an amazing resource. Um, you know, obviously, I said in the very beginning, I'm not trying to replace or give you a, a um, college course level semester program of, you know, everything about this platform because I mean come on there's there's so many more capabilities that I don't even know in this platform that exist I'm just showing you how I use it and what are the main features that I use uh, in my trading alright um, but if you go to this help tab something that you really want to make sure that you do on a pretty regular basis if you click the system button here this is going to show you um, you know what kind of memory and what kind of data usage uh, the platform is going to, uh, you know, require. And obviously, at busier times of the day, based upon your machine, based upon your uh, resources, based upon your internet connection, etc., um, it will really determine what kind of memory you have. I always go in here very regularly, at least a couple times a week, and just hit this collect garbage. And you'll see how that took me, and it freed up, you know, almost 200,000 of... Uh, you know, memory uh, it freed it up so that that just lets the system run a little bit smoother. Obviously, they do updates all the time to the platform, but that's one area where just try and get in that habit of collecting the garbage. It's kind of like clearing that temporary cache, I guess. Um, but then <clears throat> on this help button, you if you launch the learning center, uh, what I want to do is I want to bring this over here and I just want to show you what. Uh, you have access to basically uh, you know endless amounts of tutorial videos how to look at the profit charts you know super gadgets portfolio margin you can absolutely overwhelm yourself so just you know take that little uh, cautionary note if you will that uh, you just want to be uh, aware where there are more videos so let's just say you really uh, didn't like the way I explained about the scanning tab. Well, go to the videos and articles. You know, you can look at all the different features and all the different, um, you know, choices up here. If you just go to videos and articles, and let's just say you want to look more about the scan tab. Well, this will show you a, a four-minute video about Stock Hacker. All right, and then you know you can obviously populate that and play it, and it'll bring it right up for you. And it's you shouldn't place good. a trade without a good idea. Right, so I mean, it's a very good uh, additional resource. Um, give you Stock Hacker, Spread Hacker, Scanning Tab, Spread Book, Sizzle Index and Trade. I don't even know what this is all about. I have really no interest. I mean, you know, maybe some point I'll start watching some of these myself. But um, just know that the main the main tabs that I'm going to spend the mass majority of my time on are obviously the Charting Tabs and obviously the Analyze Tab. Um, and then your monitor tab is kind of like the uh, the main page, all right, if you will. That's the monitor tab, this main page, and you'll see that I have no open positions here at this point in time. Um, I'm going to build these, and just uh, as I show trades and talk about trades and talk about trade planning, um, you know, I will show you how these trades come together, kind of from start to finish, as well as it will give me good opportunities to talk about you know volatility and and what are uh, all these Greeks hold on one second okay I just wanted to log on into the to the live platform so I can show you uh, kinda what I'm talking about so uh, this is this is uh, my live platform 
It's got several accounts in it that I'm trading. And right now, this is the only position I've got on. So I'll be able to show you, you know, we'll talk about Delta, we'll talk about Gamma, Theta, Vega. We'll talk about the buying power effect and how that's impacted as far as, you know, what the positions are. Um, and, you know, just how to kind of put this all together. So my, my hope and my intent, uh, you know, I take this very seriously because I absolutely do not want anybody to lose any money unnecessarily okay um, if you go out and do something stupid and uh, you know you blow up an account because you fully don't understand it yet I that would that would make me so sad <laughs> because it's so not necessary all right you've got the capability right here uh, in a simulated environment that gives you real-time data that operates exactly like the real platform does and it lets you go in you know you can you can look at different trades and you can say okay well let me just show you this position here you, you know then I can start beginning to talk about how you manage trades what are the expectations why do you take volatility seriously um, and again you'll get to all of that um, by watching these videos that I've already put together but then also I'm gonna collect the garbage there by also going to this help tab launching a learning center and knowing that you've got access to you know plenty plenty more videos okay so uh, I hope that helps again I'm, I may add additional videos to this folder uh, as time goes on but uh, there's certainly many more videos I want to get put together and uploaded for you guys so that uh, we can make this uh, the absolute best possible experience uh, for those of you who are serious about wanting to learn options. Okay, so thank you much, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Bye.